Jack Clisby will pick it up on the near side. And gets the cross in. It's a really good one. And it's a first goal in wondrous colours inside 90 seconds of his maiden start for Marcus Antonsen, the Swede. Lovely delivery by Clisby. And Antonsen did the rest. Ninkovic. Beyond him is Antonsen. And he's found him, Milos Ninkovic. It's lovely stuff from the Wanderers. It's Borello! It's two for Western Sydney Wanderers. And Brendan Borello strikes again against the club from the city of his birth. Pick it up where he left off last season. And the Wanderers are too clear. The Wanderers have won that psychological battle by the way they've nipped and bitten and closed down and won those contested situations. A ball over the top from Marcelo is a good one. And Sonson 3 0. What a first half the Swede has had. Two goals, one assist. And that could be the hammer blow in first half stoppage time. It was a ball over the top from Marcelo. Beautifully controlled by the Swede. And what about the finish? Wanderers 3-0. Popovic. Clough again. They're just too determined, the Wanderers. On back by Bonatig. Squared up by Piraeus. Here's Ninkovic trying to pass it into the corner. It's glorious. It's four for Western Sydney Wanderers. And Milos Ninkovic has his first goal in red and black in any competition. Really well played by the Swede. Beedling trying to steer it in behind. What a ball by Tom Beedling. It's Brandon Borello. It's in. It's five for Western Sydney Wanderers. And Brandon Borello has a double. It took a while to creep over the line. And again, they should have been first the ball, but Clerk completely missed his kick. And instead, it's Goodwin who races away, has uh, Clough. Wide on the left, he opts to go right instead. It's Luka Jovanovic. And Jovanovic pushed away by Thomas. And a consolation goal for Zach Clough. And that clean sheet will not happen for Lawrence Thomas. It won't make any difference as to who's going through to the last eight. But Adelaide are on the board.